uh, more than 30 pages in that search warrant application claiming that Karen Reed fed information about her case that was not available to the public to Aiden Kearney, the controversial blogger known as Turtle Boy. In the past, her lawyer saying publicly they hadn't spoken with Turtle Boy. The blogger saying the same. But these documents say that isn't the case and that they'd been in touch for a while. Karen Reed is with me. Karen Reed's lawyers talking outside the courthouse after a hearing in 2022. Her lawyers by her side in court over the year plus since she was charged with murder in the death of her boyfriend, Boston cop John O'Keefe. Prosecutors say she hit him with her SUV outside a Canton home and left him for dead. But her lawyers say it's a cover up that O'Keefe was beaten inside the house and bitten by a dog. We love you, that theory picking up steam after controversial blogger Aiden Kearney started talking about it on his blog and in videos until he was jailed last month for witness intimidation. Now, a new search warrant application filed by state police says Reed was feeding information about her case, not meant for the public, to Kearney, who posted it on his blog. According to state police, Reed, her lawyers, and Kearney have publicly denied being in contact, but documents claim they'd been in touch for months even meeting for lunch, saying Kearney texted a friend of Karen Reed saying, quote, we had a great time. State police say Reed had used a friend to get Kearney unreleased documents, photos, and grand jury details, but say when that friendship went south, she started talking with the blogger directly, saying the two shared 189 phone calls, talking for more than 40 hours. Now we reached out to Karen Reed's lawyers who say they're not commenting at this time. Live in Dedham, Emily Maha, WCVB News Center 5. Emily, thank you for that.